We've got Ed O'Keefe also here in Des Moines. He's been covering every aspect of this race from the very beginning. Ed, good morning. How do you think it's going to shake out tonight? Well, good morning, Tony. The words of today are expect anything. That's just the way politics is these days. But if you look at CBS News polling, there is perhaps a roadmap of what to expect tonight. Bernie Sanders could come out on top. If there's signs of record high turnout, it could also benefit Mayor Pete Buttigieg. Both have focused on turning out younger and first-time caucus goers. But our polling also shows Joe Biden has a strong chance of winning, in part because he's the second choice of many caucus goers who are first set to support candidates polling in the single digits and aren't likely to meet the minimum threshold of 15 percent. They'll be invited to make a second choice, and many are expected to switch to Biden. One of the things that has struck us here in recent days is that all the talk about the issues has been pushed aside to focus instead on electability or the ability to defeat President Trump in November. And remember, despite all the attention on Iowa in recent months, just 41 delegates of the 1,990 needed to win the Democratic nomination are up for grabs tonight. Tony, a reminder, we still have a long way to go. We do indeed, Ed. Thank you very much.